Clap for me. Yeah. Clap it up for Valjean. Yeah. Clap it up for Valjean. Yeah. 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 All right, all right. Also, <laughs> couldn't leave our little brother. He's the one. He's like the rock. I'm going to let y'all know now, he's going to be like the Ernie Johnson. If y'all been paying attention to TNT with Shaq and all them, Little brother holds this whole thing together. Yes. I couldn't do it without him. My man, Devin Epps. Give it up for him. Right, Give it up for him. Uh, Ernie Johnson, but darker with more hair. Exactly. Little, little, and healthier. Yeah, a little healthier. A little no, healthier. Shade. Yeah, yeah, no shade. No shade. No shade. No shade. I'm just Ernie. saying, you know what it is. Ernie look a little sick, though. You're a little, and you're a little old. You're a little old. I also see, I got I to gotta show my man some love. I got to turn. This is my man, Rob Mad Flavor. Bam, 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 bam. When I, when I mean, when I mean... I'm going to put this. I don't want to shade any other DJs in Baltimore. <laughs> but let's just say I'm going to be nice and say he's top two. So top one of y'all, y'all, y'all can two. jump. Y'all, I'm going to say top two because, you know, somebody else listening be like, yeah, it's, a, it's me and Rob. It's me and Rob. You know what I'm saying? It's me and Rob. So, you know, let them take it. No, no. Let them take it how they want to take it. You know, that's cool. You know? That's how you do it. Like, right. He's like, yeah, the nigga definitely said two because it's me and Rob. Right? It's me and Rob. If the nigga said one, it might have been a problem. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? So, no, you know, least, we I'm go. At least, I'm at least second. Right, right. Right. Least second. <laughs> Hold up. Also, also. The man that took took the chance, gave me the opportunity to put this together. My man Diamond K, the one in charge of the whole situation. Radio on fire. We appreciate yeah. everything he's been yeah. doing. It's a classy gentleman, everything right there. Right there. Clap, 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 Diamond K. And I appreciate Diamond the fact that you're here the first time because. Thank you. See, that's right. This is what I We're not. No, 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 no. See, because the thing is, you know, I, I, I won't be shouting out the other station I was at. I have no problem with it, but it's no need to throw the shade. I'm just saying, you know, I, I'm the first time we did this thing, Dev, and you can attest to this. All jokes aside, we actually really didn't know what we were doing. We oh, were just, you know, I like to thank everybody on Facebook and social media that even gave me the um. You know, gave me the confidence to even wanting to do the radio because I was fine with just, you know, um, posting online, yeah, right. talking shit or whatever. You know. And as Facebook and social media progressed, everything started being like videos and stuff. So, you know, I'm having a good time with that. And it was people inboxing me like, yo, you should do a radio show. I'm like, yeah, yeah, whatever. That should sound Damn cool. Man, man, man. And then, you know, at, at some point in your life, like, you got to start taking those as like signs. You know what I'm saying? That you're being pointed in that direction. For things that you should be doing. What's your calling, baby? You know, so, you know, we're just trying to make things go together, and I appreciate the professionalism. Right. But I want to turn it over to Val real quick, because, see, she's she's new to the beautiful eyes of the true family. And I want I, I want her to, you know, let the people know who, she, who you are for a minute. Go ahead, talk to the people for a second. Hello, everyone. I am Val Jenkins. Um, it was a pleasure to meet these two gentlemen, and I feel honored that they – Ask me to be a part of that team. I'm excited. I'm ready, and we're going to be number one. All right. Shout, Shout out to my man Dana McDonald. That's his name. Yes, Dana He's McDonald. The one, my Dana man Dana McDonald. McDonald. Yes, Dana. He um, you know, he put the plug in, and right. my wife and everything. She put the stamp on it. You know, I know a lot of people um inbox me and stuff, and I, it wasn't on shade. It was nothing that you know I kind of went with my gut feeling. And no, I think I made appreciate the right nobody, choice. Nobody wanted you. <laughs> you we, know, we thought about it. No. See, how, you can't do that. If you Ernie Johnson, that. you can't do it. Ernie, Ernie, right. never, I mean, Ernie never shades can't. nobody. Goddamn he it, never shades nobody. I take it back. So I take it back. You can't do that. You guys you made a valiant effort. We decided to go another way. You can't do that. <laughs> so. I'm not going to lie. Sometimes you are going to probably be stupid. And get yeah, low or whatever. Well done. Well done. But, you know, a lot of people have been talking to me today. They was, um, you know, I appreciate everybody that gave me inboxes and everything. Excuse me. For, see, the old right mics wouldn't have right picked that up. See, but the old mics wouldn't have picked that up. See, but the old mics wouldn't have picked that up. That's the whole thing. That's, that's the problem. The old mics wouldn't have picked it up. I'd have to been like Curtis Blow. So, <laughs> so people, you know. <laughs> oh, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Everybody. <laughs> so you so you know, so you know, um people been inboxing me and okay. we're gonna get around to a lot of those topics too. But this right here is something that's been on my chest for about two weeks since I seen the movie Unforgettable with Rosaria Dawson and I don't know the other white guy's name, but Rosaria Dawson, that's the only one I pretty much know. That up, yeah. It was Let's a movie the white guy's name, <laughs> It was it was you'll figure it out. It was a movie it was a movie about basically this the guy, he was married, they had a child, they got divorced, he moved on, 
uh, Rosario Dawson came. You know what I'm saying? She was the next lady. And his ex-wife couldn't handle that because she felt that that was the life she should have been leading. Because, you know, that's how things should have been. But that's not even my topic. You know, dudes curve chicks all the time. Chicks curve so dudes all the time. So I get that. Really I get all that. This is the problem I have with these type of movies. This is the problem. Way, and I'm challenging y'all. And even y'all that's listening, name me one time in a movie when a black mother with a child, they get divorced and they're fine. Now, this is what I mean. I'm dead serious. Like, I've been putting a lot of thought into this. Like, you cannot name me a movie or a TV show that when the black mother is divorced, that she still has a house. She still has so it's a life changing. Like, right? It's always split this. They have to move in with a relative. Uh huh. Okay. Or they live in an apartment. Okay. Or they're homeless. Or they move to China. Some <laughs> exactly. <laughs> or they karate kid. Yeah, karate kid. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, Shout out to karate kid. Time, but at the same time, every time in the movie when the woman is white, she gets left. She still has a house. Oh, she got a shit, right? She doesn't have to move in with anybody. She takes the house from John. But this is the killer part. Get out, John. This, this is the part that kills me. This is the part that kills me. They always make it look like she's struggling, but yet she's living in a seven-bedroom house. No I'm job. Like, no job. No, no, no job. No job. No and she's throughout the movie, oh, this is, is, is hard on me. Bitch, sell the house. Right. You know what? <laughs> hey, I said to be worth Having this conversation <laughs> with a nanny. Exactly. It's always <laughs> something like that. Like, that shit, even, even with Martin. Think about, think about Martin. Think okay. about Martin, the TV show. We all see Martin, the TV show. Right. right. Why is it? Let me, let me ask you this. How much money did Gina make? More than Martin. More she made more than Okay, we know, all right, we know, we know she that. made more than him. But like, give, just give me a number. Just, just, just entertain All right, let's say, uh, I say she made about 70000 Let's say about seventy. I say I thought she made closer to six figures. Six figures? Because she got a few promotions. You know what? She did. She, 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 she wasn't she advertising. She wasn't always advertising. She got a few promotions. Maybe she started off. Maybe that was base. Okay, Base salary was 70000 So you mean to tell me you got Gina, you got Gina, uh -huh. that's about six figures. Okay. We already know what Martin made and everything, and he was... He was basically, you know, sufficient. Yeah. He was able to do things for Gina. They never had a house. They never had a house. Right. They, they, they never, put it this, even, even so episode, one they, only, they only spoke about the cars they had. Right. And the one episode that they did show a vehicle, it was all 40s. Yeah, right. You see what I'm saying? Like, yes. think about it. Gina lived with Pam. You see what I'm saying? Like, they lived together. Mm -hmm. Like, you make six figures. You know what I'm saying? When a female is living with another female, that's saving money. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? But once, even once they got married, they still lived in an apartment. apartment. One bedroom apartment to be exact. Right. Exactly. One bedroom. <laughs> exactly. Small ass Detroit apartment. I'm not even getting heavy with it, but I'm telling you, the right. TV does not let blacks get that far. Mm -hmm. They won't let them get that far. See, they, they fool us with the Cosby Show. I was about to say. I was to say that was the last time we had hope. That was the one. Was that the last time? That was the one. The Cosby Show was the one. That was, wait, that was wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Go ahead. Because yes, we, got, we, got we got some positive images out there now. Blackish is a good positive image. Now. I will let my kids watch that shit. That's good. That's good. That, you know, prominent. Uh, what I, I believe uh, Anthony Anderson is in advertising, pretty much the same job that, that uh, mm -hmm. Gina had on Martin. But then we got, uh, shit, yeah. uh, Scandal, I guess. Uh, she Don't get me on Scandal. No, I like, no. I've been tapping my feet to, uh, to Scandal lately. It's a good show. I've it's a good show. It's a good show. It ain't, it ain't the most positive thing. It ain't the most positive image for black people. But other than blackish, I don't think I have anything, man. Yeah, blackish is Why pretty good. Family, family matters. matters. Family yeah. matters is pretty cool. Uh, talking about recent. It, it was okay. It yeah. wasn't. I said he was a cop. I don't know what. What was his wife's name again? Shit. TikTok. I don't know. Don't say like nobody. Worked. Like nobody living. Right. Right. Yo, you know, you know, right. what this? She, did, she wasn't even important. She looks like a Wanda. I, I'm, I'm seeing Wanda <laughs> in my head, but that's not a name. That wasn't a name. And oh, see, see, family. T um, what is it? Family matters. Family matters. matters. What you call? I'm gonna say family ties. We know what Michael Keaton did, but um, <laughs> I said Michael Keaton. You just said Michael Keaton. I, with a straight face, Michael J. Fox. Michael J. Fox. Okay, that's exactly. what you meant. My bad. My it's a little bad. older. No, what I'm saying is, notice how they had the sister living with them. You see what I'm saying? They're going to uh -huh. stay giving black people the extended <laughs> The divorce family. one, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Little Ricky living with Yeah, a little light skin with the, with the, uh, That's what I'm saying. Yeah, the, it was the all black mullet. stuff going on. He was, he was light skin, so they let him slide. They let him slide with the whole kind of thing. You can't be dark skin and sleeping on the couch. It's not going to work. It's just going to perpetuate the stereotype. I'm telling you. So what's going on, Rod? What's going on, baby? Hey, so a lot going on over here. A um, couple people feeling the, the conversation that we're talking about, uh, you know, the images that we see out there. So, you know, we always want something positive, but, you know, 
Some people might say we got to start somewhere, but we already started and the race is rolling, so we want to see some more positive energy. Some facts. Uh, Harriet. Harriet was the mom's name on Family Matters. That was the thing. Harriet. Oh, See, Harriet. This is the Google Master. Thanks, Mr. Google. Google. Thanks, Mr. Google. Thanks, Mr. Google. Thanks, Mr. Shit was driving me crazy. I got <laughs> quiet. <laughs> Just doing stuff. Yeah, then I got quiet. I don't find out. Yeah, when I got quiet, I'm researching some shit. Analytics. Somebody's got to do it. Yeah, got to do it, right? Somebody's got to do it. Somebody's got to do it. But never mind the positive images. I'm going by the images that I'm seeing. Let's get to the negative shit. The nice negative. What's going on with y'all ladies? Oh shit! In yeah, general, I'm, jump, I'm jumping straight there. Mm. We gonna be going yeah. straight there. What's going on with y'all? What, what do you want to know? <laughs> what do you want to know? Okay. Ask the question. Matter of fact, so I'm just going to come off the chest. Fine. Do it. In a relationship, Uh-oh. even though I keep hearing women yeah, saying yes. I've been single for so long, I've been doing things by myself for so long that I don't know how to be to submiss or be submissive. What's going on with that? So you go be on live and tell my single business. <laughs> that's just <a> <laughs> <laughs> one, one personalized to you, says so. like, like, right. 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 Generalities. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. What Everybody, do you want to know? I want. Ask the question. We ready? The question is this: go for it. Do y'all want to be the man in the relationship or the woman? You can't be both. Mm. Speak up. You can't be both, but. I can only speak for myself. No, no, no. You no, don't, you I don't have to speak, speak for, for myself. You have to speak for women. It's, it's hard. No, you're piss it's really off. hard. We want you to speak in generalities. It's really hard. I know it's hard for me. I mean, I work three jobs. I, I don't like saying men is intimidated. Not out loud, anyway. Intimidated. <laughs> right. Intimidated but it, it's hard. By, it's hard by, for by, me by, so, uh, in, in what women. I deal with. You know, a man is so quick to say, I could do, I could do, I could do. But they really can't. So with me, I work oh, three shit. jobs. Ooh. Okay. So that that's they feeling like damn, what you need me for? For so, real. So you got no so time for no man. I, I make I'm I'm a family person. I okay. don't make time. The blessing of me working three jobs, I could basically come and go as I please. Okay. All right. So it's not a man out here to just say I don't spend time with him. I have all my own. That's all materialistic stuff. I was I was loving my single life. I was loving it. Traveling once a month for seven years, doing me, paying my bills, awesome credit. Now I'm ready to settle down. But with who? I'm not dating a man with kids under 21. I don't want them. Because ain't no man going to tell me it's my weekend. Nope, it's my weekend. So <laughs> <laughs> really? So, I mean, you want me to go on? No, because I'm saying they don't have passports. How you gonna travel with me without a passport? Get I need a, you to have a passport. Buy him one. There you go. No, I hear it all the jobs. time. This is what three I hear all the time. When I meet buy, a man with no passport. passport. I'm gonna give you a chance. Oh, I'm gonna go and get my passport tomorrow. But tomorrow ends up three months later, and you still don't have a passport. So the way I look at it, one, you don't have a desire to broaden your horizon, oh, or two, oh, you one. owe child support. There you go. That was, or three, that was mine. That was you my have a one. criminal history. This is going to stop you from getting a passport. I don't want that in my life. I'm drama free. So you, I want to travel. I go to three countries a year. What, where are you going to take me at? Safeway. There you Come go. For, I'm just it saying. It ain't going to happen. I'm just saying. So come on, next question. <laughs> well, son, son. So you talking about you. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, so so what do you feel? Okay, so with so if your, your three job having ass, uh, <laughs> working, exactly. working, you don't need a man for shit. That's okay, no, okay, you don't. Okay, you that's don't. That's a, okay, Maybe. so what? I'm Park Heights. Okay. Boom, Park Heights, California. Oh, uh, that goes from <laughs> Israel to Jamaica over there. Okay. okay. Come on. Bro. So, so it's your three job having ass, and you know, you're feeling like men are intimidated by you. What do you feel intimidates them? Is it the fact that you really don't need a man financially? Then maybe you should let them know what you need. Other than the financial, because I mean, you know, all men feel like that that's a, almost our role right. to come in, you know, and, and be I'm, a provider. I'm going to let you play your role. Okay. I'm going to let all right, you cool. play your role. Right. I don't need him financially. Okay. I would love for him to come and bring more to the table. Right. I'm not going to stop you from bringing more to the table. It's pretty hard. He's competing with three jobs. Yeah, right. right. <laughs> He's competing with three jobs. Like, shit, that's. I, I don't need, I don't, I'm not that woman who's going to take care of man. And I don't want a man to take care of me. But I want you to come to the table and we can bring it together. 
That sounds cool. It's sure enough. That, that's, that, that's, that's the ideal. It's everybody, sure enough. Everybody wants to fight for the defense of Poodle Dog and a boy and girl. Let me tell you this. The argument happens. Exactly. Let me tell you this. What's the argument? People. Go ahead, Rod. Okay, when the argument happens, it's already on the tip of your tongue that I don't need you. There you go. There you go. But where the argument start from? That's balls. Start from a lot of different things. No, no, yeah, give me but it's always the end of the argument. It's about where the argument ends. No, where it starts. Let's start. just say he didn't come home on time. Okay, that's why we had cell phones. And okay, so maybe he answer the phone. Maybe he phone maybe, maybe, maybe he didn't hear the phone, or maybe he didn't. He didn't okay, answer, or whatever. He just wasn't. And then when he gets home, uh -huh. and the conversation goes there, goes so, where? Come on now, you want me simple. to be real? No, you keep it real. Come on. Something as simple as. Hey, I could have called, but I didn't. I was with my boys. We were drinking. We were shooting balls. Something came Something up. Something came up, and it didn't go the way you would like it to go. It's all about communication. Communication. Okay, okay so when you get there, as long as will the conversation ever go, you know, you need to you need to be on the right path. You need mm -hmm. to, well, you know, I need to be let know what's going on, or it won't be no more us. I don't need you at that point. You understand what I'm getting at? Because Always. he didn't come home one time? Because he didn't communicate. It's, it's, all relationships is, is about communication. Yeah, communication. It's about, yeah. if you want to go out and hang out with your boys, that's fine. Mm -hmm. I don't want a man under me all the time. Mm -hmm. Go and play basketball with your boys. Mm -hmm. But if we say we're going somewhere at 6 o'clock and you find yourself running over, it takes five seconds right. to say, I'm running over. Fine. <laughs> But the conversation will not turn into, cannot turn into. Not because he running late. I run, I'm the latest person in the world. Especially when people give me the wrong address. Oh, oh that was all oh, that shit. Shit. <laughs> shit. shit. That shade came from nowhere. Please. Shit. So, <laughs> uppercut shade. So come on, you got to come at me better than that. Oh, yeah. I'm just come saying. On. Come on. So, I'm saying it is oh. something, but it just ain't that. It ain't right. that. Exactly. It ain't it's okay. going to be. And in I'm every relationship, you're going to have disagreements. Now, all I'm saying is, is that we talk about you. Okay. You won't turn that argument into most women. It depends on what it's turn that conversation into. You know, I don't need so you. I feel like as black men, we don't it's, respond it's well to threats. It's not all about I, I don't need you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because do you really need them? You can strongly desire them. Mm -hmm. We're sexual beings. Mm -hmm. And to for any woman or man to say, I don't need a woman or man, mm -hmm. you're DJing. Men don't, <laughs> men don't say that. Sorry. No, we'll say That's that. the problem. I That's that. I'm glad you we'll said that. that. Right. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. I'm glad you said yes, that. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. Men do not. Men. You don't say men don't say, I don't need you. No, we don't talk about women like that. We actually don't. Like, no, no we need you. you want to peek inside the barbershop? I'm giving you a peek right now. No, no man, yeah, it, when we sitting around throwing them back, I'm just saying throwing them back because most dudes Man, I don't, I, don't I don't need her. No, I don't need her. What, what, I'm, saying, <laughs> what I'm telling you now, we don't, we, don't, we, don't, we, don't, we don't walk around saying, yo, I don't need no woman. Because we know that's a lie. We because you already have about five of them. There are no, there are no guys nights out. There are no guys night out. There is no... Ain't no look, ain't no bitches tonight, dog. Exactly. We don't go out. We exactly. just go and watch the days for real. I don't want to nothing about no bitches. Yo, little no. brother, little brother. The funny, <laughs> thing, the funny thing about the funny thing about guys night out, yeah. it's all about bitches. women. It's all about them. All it's about women. Not about women. It's not about, about women. Those are about camaraderie right. whatsoever. Yeah, right. not say, look. I don't need women, but they will say I don't need you. No, that's what we. That's what they we. Specific. Specific. That is very because specific. That is very specific. They that's already specific. got Tony and Charlie no more. We'll say that. We'll say I don't need this. I don't need this shit. Yeah, yeah. right. It's, it's exactly. All, it's, it's, it's the hassle. It's all the same. It's the hassle. It's all the same thing. It's, it's, the, same it's the same difference. It's not the same. It's the same difference. I feel like no, honestly, I feel that. like the hassle that women get from men. You guys are willing to throw the whole entire species away. When we will just, you know, hey, let's try the next one. I feel like, I I honestly, I that. feel like you guys, you guys that. will sour. Once one man has done you wrong, you will sour on all men, as opposed to men who will just, ah, uh, more fish in the sea. They gonna okay. discount I, all nope. y'all. That's what's going on here. Leave it, what's up? Women Leave. will get hurt 100 times. Men, let me say. I men will hurt say. women ahead. 100 ahead. times. Mm -hmm. And he want to go to McDonald's and Big Mac or whatever. Let that one woman hurt him. 
Every woman is a bitch hole in the slot. And you want to go to Moe's and get a dag on big crab cake or something. You hurt. You broke. Oh, sounds, God. I can't believe specific. this. Sounds like you, you want to tip your life. She wants the big steak. She wants everybody to feel sorry for She out there treating Moe's like it's Philippe's. <laughs> <laughs> like, come on. Layla said, men, men may not say it to a woman's face. They may say, man, I don't need her to a, you know, another man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But they won't say it to a woman's face. Yeah. I agree with that. But either way, they're yeah. going to say it. That's true. That's true. Listen, this is what we're trying to explain, <laughs> sister. <laughs> this is this whole thing. I told myself I was going to bring it down this whole time. I'm, I'm starting over a new freshness. So I'm keeping it How fresh there. is the freshness? It's fresh, it's fresh, it's fresh. Come on. Now, like you said, when us guys say, when we say we don't need a woman, we're not talking about women species. We're talking about that one well, chick. And I said right. that. But it's just her. I, I just her. said her. that. That's it. I don't need you. And I said, see, but the so thing is So by the time he gets to the car, he already calling about texting. No, he going to do the text because he going to do the group text. And the first woman to answer, boom, that's the one he's going to. I'm saying. glad you know that, though. Oh, well, that I was, do know. That was very good because I'm glad you know that I because know a lot – Explain to some of y'all women out here that be curving dudes and really think that y'all really making a difference. No. He sent you that text. He sent it to twelve other recipients. Yep. Whoever is answer writing, first. that's who he's going uh, for. Yep. Uh, whoever answer first. See, when I was a rubber and runner, I used to have a, I used to have a whole team. You used to have my star five. You got your point guard. She's mm -hmm. your, that's your number one. Star player. Yep. Star player. And you got your shooting guard. <laughs> your shooting guard is waiting right for mm -hmm. you because can handle she's the rock. already down. This should can handle the rock, but now, you don't really want her having really, all responsibilities exactly, all the time. Exactly. Yeah. Now, the three guard, I like to stop with one through three, mm -hmm. really, because the, the three, three. See, the point, that's the wingman. I'm bringing down you. Three. See, yeah. no, the wingman, I'm going to bring down all positions for you. I don't know how much you know basketball. So now the wingman, that's the one that's like, okay, looks between... One in the ten, she's about seven. She's about a seven. She got a nice to decent, decent to nice body. Mm -hmm. Doesn't really get on your nerves too much. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? She's kind of always available. Minds her business. And if she's not, exactly, minds, minds her, business. her business. And if she's not available, she's kind of mm -hmm. like, oh, well, whatever. Now, when you get to them damn fours and fives, that's your garbage line. What's a jump? That's your jump. 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 See, listen, oh you got two, Grab that. you got two Stop kind break. of women. And I, you know what's funny with that? You, you said you got two kind of, you got a billion, women. but two types of women. Okay. You got the 8 o'clock and 2 in the morning. There you go. 1 through 3 is probably 8 o'clock. Is that 8 a.m. or 8 p.m.? 8 p no, that's 8 p.m. Okay. That's p.m. Yeah, that's p.m. Yeah. 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 When you see me, I got you. Right. Right. Still be doing other shit right them. now. Right. Right. 2 o'clock, that's a design shit. I'm four, just you see what's up with four and five, mm -hmm. and that's it. Damn, the, the night you fell asleep. The night didn't go. You fell asleep on eight o'clock. Is that night didn't go? How I planned it to go. So we go start with four and five. And four and five is always ready. By oh, yeah. the way, always. They always ready because you know why they always ready because they can be cut at any time. Exactly. And Little Caesars, they, they gotta be hot and ready. <laughs> they can be, be hot and ready. Their contracts are not guaranteed. Little Caesars, baby. <laughs> their contracts are not guaranteed. Unfortunately, I agree with you. Unfortunately, I agree with you. Well, right. You're absolutely right. Well, let's take this opportunity of agreements and uh, agreements. Is that a word? Agreements. I think Agreed. that's about a word. Yeah. Uh, let's play some music, Diamond K. Take a little break and regroup. We'll be right back. We'll be right back, man. Be right back. Right back. Yep. So that's why I'm just. Yeah, man. That's why.